Good evening. Thanks for joining us tonight. I'm Tim Seaman. Bridget Bennett has this week off. Well, for years, Sioux City has been looking for ways to improve Chris Larson Park and the riverfront. Now it looks like it actually might happen. City Council just this evening getting a look at final plans for a proposed redevelopment of about 12 acres. That's our top story tonight at 6. KCAU 9's Jacob Russo is following the developments. He joins us live tonight from City Hall, where Council heard that presentation. Jacob? Tim, the Riverfront Development Board and the architecture firm in charge of designing Chris Larkin, Larson Park met in City Council Chambers tonight to present that final plan to the City Council for the development of that riverfront area. This new plan in, removes some of the attractions that were included in earlier plans, like a Ferris wheel, but it retained items like a flower garden, basketball courts, and multiple lawns and playgrounds for recreation. You know, not every city has what we have. We have a river going right through our town. And this is the jewel of our city. And we have to take advantage of it because we only get one shot at it and we have to do it right. Um, we have great ideas. We have great um, uh, plans. To move Tom forward. Rogers, the architect behind the riverfront design, says he values the chance to change the face of the city. That transformational opportunity is huge. It happens once, right? It, it's not every day or every lifetime that you get to take that big of a change or make that big of a change in your downtown on the river. The plan is for the city to put six million dollars towards this project over the next five years. The total cost of construction is projected to be around 16 million dollars. As for construction, that should start in March of 2020 with the first phase of construction being finished by the summer of 2021. Live in Sioux City, Jacob Russo, KCAU 9 News.